Fluidization is a process whereby a granular material is converted from a static solid-like state to a dynamic fluid-like state. This process occurs when a fluid is passed up through the granular material, such as sand or in our case tiny glass beads. A fluidized bed is created when a gas flow is introduced at the bottom of a bed. The gas flow will move upwards through the grains via the empty spaces between the particles. When the velocity is high enough, it will begin to counteract the gravitational forces. The weight of the grains is then compensated through the upward flow of the gases. This will increase the space between the grains, allowing them to move among each other more freely. The internal friction between the grains gets reduced and the glass beads are able to swim around like particles in a liquid do. With our method, we achieve this by putting tubes in a spiral shape on the bottom of a small bucket. We made small holes in the tube and connected it to a high air pressure. Then we filled up the bucket with our glass beads. You can also see a difference when placing objects on the surface of the fluidized glass beads. Some objects will sink and some objects will float. This has to do with the buoyancy force. The buoyancy force is a function of the density of the surrounding fluid times the volume of the object times the gravity. When the buoyancy force is greater than the gravitational force, the object will float. When the buoyancy force is smaller than the gravitational force, the object will sink. When you cut off the air, it freezes. A jingle bell swing and jingle bells ring Snowing and blowing, a bushels of fun Now the jingle hop has begun 